Hi guys and welcome back to Lingoni. My name is Jenny and today we're going to talk about the definite article D, which is the feminine article. There are three genders in German, masculine, feminine and neutral. In the last video about definite articles, we talked about the article der. If you missed that video, you can check it out right here. When you learn a new noun in German, you should always learn it in combination with the article. There are certain rules you can learn, which we will cover today for the article D, but it's going to help you a whole lot if you just always memorize the noun together with the article. All right, let's get started. Feminine professions in German use the article D such as die Ärztin, die Pilotin, die Busfahrerin, die Physiotherapeutin, die Osteopathin, die Arzthelferin, die Krankenschwester, die Chefin, die Geschäftsführerin, die Projektmanagerin, die Erzieherin, die Lehrerin, die Astronautin, die Politikerin, die Verkäuferin und so weiter. Names of ships and airplanes are also feminine. Die Titanic oder die Boeing 747. Names of motorcycle brands are also feminine. Die Harley Davidson. Cardinal numbers are feminine. Die 1, die 2, die 3, die 4, die 5, die 6, die 7, die 8, die 9, die 10, die 50, die 100, die 1000 und so weiter. Names of plants and trees are mostly feminine, such as die Tulpe, die Rose, die Birke, die Eiche, die Fichte, aber der Ahorn und das Feilchen. Words with the suffix F-A-L-T, Falt, are feminine, die Vielfalt oder die Sorgfalt. Words with the suffix Heit are feminine, die Sicherheit, die Unsicherheit, die Frechheit, die Blödheit, die Dummheit und so weiter. Words with the suffix kite are feminine. Die Möglichkeit, die Schnelligkeit, die Ahnungslosigkeit. Words with the suffix schafft are feminine. Die Freundschaft, die Mannschaft, die Kundschaft. When nouns are derived from verbs and they end in T, they're feminine. Die Fahrt, die Tat, die Arbeit und so weiter. Words with the suffix ung are feminine. Die Rechnung, die Leitung und die Zeitung. There are some foreign nouns with specific suffixes that are also feminine, such as the suffix ade, die Parade oder die Marmelade. Words with the suffix age are also feminine, such as die Garage oder die Passage. Words with the suffix ans are also feminine, such as die Eleganz, die Dominanz oder die Arroganz. Words with the suffix ens are also feminine, die Existenz oder die Tendenz. Words with the suffix ik are feminine, die Kritik oder die Musik. Words with the suffix ion are feminine, die Diskussion, die Koalition, die Organisation. Die Sektion, die Lotion. Words with the suffix tet are feminine. Die Identität oder die Qualität. Words with the suffix ur are feminine, such as die Reparatur oder die Agentur. Most words that end in e are feminine, and this is going to be really helpful because there are a lot of words in German that end in e, such as die Grenze, die Lampe, die Klappe, which is another way um, to say mouth, but it's actually more colloquial. Like you can say, halt die Klappe, which is not very nice. It means shut up. <laughs> die Runde, die Lunge, und so weiter. But there are exceptions such as der Löwe, der Junge, der Friede. Words that end in IE are feminine. Die Diplomatie, die Psychologie, die Ironie, but there are exceptions such as der Junkie, der Hippie oder das Genie. Nouns with the suffix ei are also feminine, such as 
die Metzgerei, die Bäckerei, die Abtei. But there are exceptions such as das Ei oder der Papagei. Words that end in in are usually feminine, such as die Ärztin, die Studentin, die Kunden. But das Benzin is an exception. All right, today you learned which nouns in German take the article D, so which of them are feminine. Like I said at the beginning of the video, make sure whenever you learn a new noun to always learn it together with the article. In the next video, we're going to talk about the article das. By the way, you can learn three languages at Lingoni now. We have German, English, and French. You can check out all of those languages on Lingoni.com. We'll see you there. Bis bald. Tschüss.